In this video, let us learn to draw the ER diagram for hotel management system. The first step is we need to choose the entities. So what is an entity? Entity is an object with physical existence or conceptual existence. So in this hotel management system, hotel is an entity. Hotel is physically existing. Therefore it is an entity. Next, rooms. Room is physically existing, therefore it is an entity. Next is guest. Guest is a person and person is physically existing, therefore it is an entity. Entity must be written inside a rectangular box. So draw the rectangular box. Write the first entity name which is hotel. Next rectangular box. Write the next entity name which is rooms. Next rectangular box and write the third entity name which is guest. So three entities are hotel, room and guest. The next word that comes into our mind is attributes. Attribute is the characteristics of entity. Characteristics of hotel is attribute. Characteristics of room is attribute. Characteristics of guest is attribute. Attribute must be written inside oval shape. So what are all the attributes of hotel? Hotel will have an ID. So hotel ID. ID will be unique for every hotel. Therefore it is a primary key. So it must be underlined. Next name of the hotel. Next phone number of that hotel. So that the guest can contact. Next the address of the hotel. Next it is city of that hotel. So in which city the hotel is located. Next the attributes of room we should write. Room will also have a number. So room number. And each room will be having a unique number. Therefore, it is a primary key. So, we need to underline the room number. Next, the price of that room. Next, the type of that room. Room type. Whether it is AC room or non-AC room. Whatever. Next, what are all the attributes of guests? Guest will also have a guest ID which is unique for every guest. Therefore, it is a primary key. It must be underlined. Next, address of that guest. Next, name of that guest. Now, we have drawn the rectangular box inside which we have written the entity name and surrounded by its attributes which is written inside the oval shape. So after filling this, we need to connect all the entities. So for connecting the entities, we use relationship, which will be represented using a diamond box. And then I'll connect using the lines. So diamond box is going to connect two entities. Diamond box is known as the relationship. So hotel Inside this I will write has. Hotel has rooms. And then guest will book room. So guest books room. Hotel has room. So the flow is hotel has rooms. And those rooms will be booked by the guest. Departure date and arrival date of the Guest is also very important. Departure date. So the date the guest is expected to leave the hotel. That is departure date. Next is arrival date. The date in which the customer or the guest is expected to come to the hotel in order to stay in the room that is arrival date so this is the er diagram for hotel management system 
the hotel will have rooms and those rooms will be booked by the guest the arrival date and the departure date will be given to the guest if you like this video please like share and subscribe thank you